Hey guys, it's me Stormy and here's your weekly horoscope for the week of February 5th. So congratulations to our giveaway winner last week. The giveaway that I've got going for you this week is a spot into my new Astrology 101 Basics class starting March, going from March 10th all the way until April 7th. So all you've got to do if you want to come learn the Astrology Basics with me is head over to the Facebook, um, like the page, leave me a comment, and definitely share something you find on the Facebook that you find fascinating. The link to the Facebook is in the description box down below. All right, this week, let me tell you what, you guys, there is this dichotomy between what you want, what you need, what you should be doing, what you're not doing, right? There is just this grand, really interesting energy moving this week because the sun is coming into conflict with two different bodies, but then we get to the end of the week kind of making it all come together and we've got Venus moving into Pisces. So this is really bringing some soft energy to the table. So let's take a look at what that looks like. Now this week we're going to have the sun in Aquarius, right? And it is coming over, first of all, touching base right here on Wednesday, February 7th with the moon. And the moon is over here here in Scorpio and this creates a little bit of a struggle right mm -hmm. so here's this space where the Sun you think you know what you want you think you want to do you think you know who you are what your essence is this is who I am this is what I'm about you know what I mean and it's coming into this struggle and conflict energy with the moon who is in Scorpio saying let go transform we need to transform i need you to put that down so there could be this struggle that you're feeling this week for sure whenever the sun and the moon even though on the seventh this is only for a day but anytime the sun and the moon come into this kind of opposing conflict of the want and the need we certainly feel it and so what happens sometimes is a little internal chaos but mostly we find out that we have done nothing we've taken no action right we have a sense of procrastination going on which I think we definitely see caught up with us as we get here to Saturday February 10th first the Sun is gonna go over here and take on Jupiter right the Sun the doer the bringer of life and heat Jupiter not only the expander but really a great procrastinator <laughs> as well so that space between what you want where you want to go what you should be doing who you think you are is taking on your ability to expand, maybe your lack of action, um, maybe your lack of knowledge to be able to expand. But I do, I'm telling you here, as we get to the end of the day here on Saturday, um, whatever the state you find yourself in, um, whatever you find out, wherever you find out that maybe your wants and your needs are colliding, maybe you find out that your action and your movement or your desires are in collision. With Venus moving into Pisces, this is kind of a healing, magic, easy, forgiving, compassionate salve that I think gets posted on and we get to use for the whole rest of the week, right? And it's really the space where it says, all right, calm down. Maybe you haven't figured it all out. Maybe you're not doing everything perfectly. Hell, maybe you're not doing anything at all at this point, but you're going to have to approach yourself and others with a fair sense of compassion and forgiveness and a willingness to move and transform to a different place by letting some things in your shadow sectors go gonna be a good week I think I really actually feel like the next four weeks with this Venus and Pisces energy being here are actually all to the benefit you're gonna see yourself move in a different way some of which will be very very creative but mostly what I think happens for everyone is the things that we've been attached to maybe even some really unhealthy self-sabotaging behaviors we start to see how to be able to put those down as Venus makes this move through Pisces and we're also very attractive to creative things and maybe even a little uh, money in our backyards as well. So like this video, comment, share, subscribe. I hope you like my cute little piece I'm wearing. It came from my friends over at Hair Entourage. You want to know more about them, see their selection, see their pieces, or just know about these people because this is one of us guys this company came from our tribe of people so find out what's going on with them in the description box down below all right i hope to see you guys in three dollar thursday which you can still click in the description box down below and join as well i hope to see you whether by being the winner or by coming to sign up for my new astrology 101 basics class it's been reformatted i'm launching it out in march and for the march session only you can take all five weeks with me for $50. This class is normally 200 
$125. But anytime I do something new, I like to throw it at you so you can come sample it with me. All right, guys, all of those registrations and details and signups and all of that are in the description box down below. Like this video, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next week, beauties. Bye.